I'm Ashlyn and my husband is Zach and we're traveling A to Z. Join us as we go explore different parts of Northern and Southern Ireland. We're currently heading south of Dublin to Glendalow Monastic Site. We're currently in Glenlock to go check out the old monastery and the big tower that is St. Kevin. We are visiting the monastic city, the monks and the monastery. So this is the gates of the old monastery that was made by St. Kevin and it was from the 6th century. So this is a walled monastery to help protect uh, the people that lived here. You can see part of it and the entrance and then they have a little cross as you walk in. So Kevin was a guy that walked from Dublin and ended up in this little area and he became a monk and then over years um, about 200 other people came here to become a monk and they made this monastery and here they have a tower which is one of the most preserved tallest finished towers in the area they also have one of the oldest cemeteries and a lot of other ruins of the monastery it's a really neat little place to explore minus the rain this is a really old cemetery one of the oldest cemeteries around and it's over a thousand years old and then they have a new cemetery next to it so behind me is the new cemetery so people could still be buried there and if you have family in the old cemetery you could be buried there also uh, but most people are getting in the new cemetery now we're heading to the round tower which is over a thousand years old and it's a complete round tower the round tower is built as a tower for um, a bell tower and they also the monks used to go up there to help protect themselves and behind me is the Celtic cross so this is the church which is in the monastery and it was the biggest church of its time I think it was from like the 12th century or so pretty neat you could still see kind of the windows um, and all the ruins around If you hug the cross and touch your hands, it should be good luck. <laughs> we'll see. This is Kevin's Kitchen. Uh, they didn't cook here. They just called it that because they saw smoke coming out of the tower. So some guy named Kevin walked over here from Dublin. And he was kind of into God and stuff. So he decided to become a monk. And eventually they made him a Saint Kevin. So this is... St. Kevin's Kitchen. This is inside of St. Kevin's house. <laughs> so this tree right here is called a yew tree. Apparently they thought that the yew tree warded off evil spirits and so whenever they were kind of worried about somebody was going to get them they would plant a yew tree to keep them protected from the evil. I guess. Makes sense in a cemetery. And this tree apparently is poisonous, so they would use it at the end of arrows to help protect themselves. This was a fun little monastery to visit outside of Dublin. Join us next week as we go to Kilkenny and explore the cute little medieval town. If you enjoyed watching, please subscribe below to follow more of our adventures.